Do you know what's paradoxical about anti-nutrients? They block nutrient absorption, yet they also help fight disease. Look at this list of foods. What do they all have in common? They are considered some of the healthiest foods on the planet, yet every single one of them contains so-called anti-nutrients. Anti-nutrients. Sounds bad, right? But they have another name, phytochemicals. And if that word sounds familiar, it's because these are the very compounds linked to longevity and disease prevention. Antinutrients, or phytochemicals, have a hermetic effect. They act as a mild stressor, but in a good way. Just like exercise or fasting makes the body stronger, antinutrients push the body to adapt and build resilience. Take broccoli and Brussels sprouts. They contain goitrogens, which can interfere with iodine uptake, but they are also rich in sulforaphane, which lowers heart disease risk and helps to toxify harmful compounds. Or chia seeds and legumes. Their phytates, tannins and lectins can reduce mineral absorption or disrupt digestion, but they also have strong anti-inflammatory properties and are loaded with antioxidants that fight free radicals. You see the pattern? Antinutrients are a double-edged sword. While they can block some minerals, their hormetic effect may actually strengthen the body's defenses and support long-term health. So should you be worried about antinutrients? With nutrition, it's rarely black and white. And antinutrients are no exception. Instead of avoiding them, the key is balance and variety. This way, you get the best of both worlds. Phytochemical benefits and the nutrients your body needs.